Welcome to the State Department briefing room again for a special briefing. Uh, this is on the record. Uh, Dennis Ross, the uh, Special Middle East Coordinator, will take your questions. I think Dennis will uh, uh, will not do any kind of a statement up front, but just uh, go immediately to what you're interested in. So, Dennis, without further ado, and we'll go for about 15, 20 minutes. Dennis. I'll take your question. The open issues that were previously settled, drags out with Chairman Arafat and Europe, do you hear? What has happened is there is an intensive set of discussions that have gone on. Uh, draft texts have been developed. Uh, considerable progress has been made in, in, uh, in all the areas that have been discussed. We have basic agreement in the civil area. Uh, we have substantial agreement in the security areas, but we, don't have, we haven't resolved all the questions yet. In Gamesh, since this is a new team of Israeli negotiators and since the old teams obviously knew each other better. The nature of our role has been um, really indispensable in, in helping them come together, in helping them find the way to conduct these negotiations, and in helping them find ways also to bridge differences that, uh, that come up. They each have a very high level of trust in us, and uh, we want to play this role to help them but we also want to play the role in a way that doesn't begin to have a substitute for one of them. ...be open during the night, but the other one was going to be resolved at the... Had there been a meeting... There was no the understanding at the table. Some of the difficulties in this discussion, this negotiation, has been a function that each side has, has concerns about the other. Uh, each side is looking at a very delicate situation. Each is highly sensitive to trying to ensure that the measures and mechanisms that they're going to agree upon and then implement will hold because they both know the, the, uh, the sensitivity of Hebron.